the guy, it was eerie because it was just so true to life. I mean, I was watching it, I was laughing, I was really enjoying it, I have to say first. But it was so real and I felt like both like men and women had so much they could learn from it because we've all been in that situation where we kind of mistook somebody um, for being, I guess, from a woman's point of view, Prince Charming. Right. And then not recognizing something else that might be there um, right. as well. Uh, but if you could just tell me a bit about how this whole um, story came about and um, the characters. Sure. I mean, you know, one of the goals of the film was to portray as realistically and truthfully as possible the, the dating world in, in big cities. could be anywhere, but here it's New York City. Um, and also the, the culture of Wall Street. You know, the guys are... Uh, you know, Wall Street sales guys, yeah, which is, you know, perfect for, for kind of the lessons that I'm trying mm -hmm. to, like, get, get across here. Um, and, you know, ultimately the film is, is supposed to be entertainment, but it, there is a bit of a message in there. And it is kind of a, a cautionary tale um, about this, the, uh, the realities of dating in, in big cities. And so the characters, if we could kind of just give a composite of some of the, the main ones, there was Tommy, yep. uh, Daniel. Tommy, Daniel, and, and Beth, Beth are the three people who are involved. That you know, mm -hmm. Tommy is the mentor of Daniel and sets up kind of a, an all about Eve kind of situation where mm -hmm. he takes him under his wing and then introduces Daniel, and he who's seems a bit so fantastic. And yeah, and Tommy's you know really Tommy is the quintessential good guy. You know, he's mm -hmm. really charming and sweet, uh, and Daniel's the kind uh, of the, bit awkward, really as well. awkward, <laughs> and uh, you know, but but ultimately, uh, you know, Beth. You know, starts out with one and, and develops a sort of a, a real friendship with Daniel, and then, mm -hmm. you know, things kind of progress, and you you may not end up exactly how you thought it would at the beginning, but I think you know this isn't a cynical story; it's it's, it, it's a love all. story, and everyone gets what they deserve. You know, it, it really is.